Hello everyone. Very affectionate greetings from Clifford International School. In previous video, we have seen how to make an appointment using the Clifford app. Now we are going to learn how to use student login. So first, click on the student login. You will see login window. Please enter all the credentials provided by the school. That is your username and password. I'm already doing it. Once you logged in successfully, you will see the dashboard. To extreme upward left side, click on profile icon. In this option, you can edit or update your personal details. So let's see how we can update it. Click on the profile first. So as we can see, we are having our personal details here. You can update the details. That is your academic years detail, then students detail. And you can also upload your photo by clicking on the image icon. After making changes in details, just click on save and then your details are updated successfully. So let's come back to the dashboard. Step 2. To the extreme left corner, you will see a button that is a three lines menu. Click on that button. So after clicking on the menu, you can see the options, dashboard, teachers, academic, etc. Now let's start with our first option that is teachers. Click on teachers. In the teachers section, you will be provided by a list which includes detail of all the faculties working with Clifford with their email and contact. So if you need to contact directly, you can find the contact resource of the desired person. Second option is academics. Click on the academics. In the academics, you will find two sub options that is subject. In subject, you will find all your subject list with author, publication and subject code. As we can see here. In second option, with timings and your teacher name so next option is leave application in the leave application option you can see your previous leave dates and you can also apply for a new leave so for new leave request First click on leave request, then select the leave type. For example, we are taking sick leaves. Select your leave dates. After that, select the reason. Suffering with fever. And if you have any attachment, then you can attach by clicking on this icon. And then at the last, click save. Your leave request will be reviewed as approved, pending or rejected by the school authority. Next option is attachment books. In the attachment books option, you will see all the notes, reference books or other study material uploaded by the teacher and you can download it using the app anytime. 
so next option is homework in the homework section you will find the list of homework given by your teachers so we can see the homework is already given here the next option is exam master in exam master there are two sub options first one is exam schedule in this you can find out your desired exam timetable and the second option will be report card but in the report card it will reflected only after checking the papers so let's move to the next option next option is attendance in the attendance section you can view your monthly attendance select the desired month and click filter your attendance of that particular month will be reflected okay so the next option will be fee history in the fees history you can see your paid fees balance fees and upcoming payment date also okay next option will be message message section is a direct chat option for the parent or student to communicate with the school staff to communicate with the reference person you just need to follow some tiny steps once you click the message you'll get a window like this there is a list of your previous communication and you can send a new message using compose button so i'm clicking on it after clicking on compose you'll see some more options select the role in which department you have a query so for example i'm clicking on the teacher select the receiver that is the concerned person select any teacher that is concern and then enter your message you can also attach the file if you have any and then click on the send button the concerned person will reply you asap in the same message section you will be able to assess all the resources as per your class and have a splendid experience hope this video helps you to assess smoothly if you still have any query you can contact us on our it helpline number 8983019553 thank you